Yo, what is going on guys? We're back finally with another mod review and today we're going to check out the generic 1500. This kind of looks like a Dodge Ram and that's ultimately what it is. We have it fully tuned, no frills, spare parts in the box, and winter tires. Stop and take a look. And race suspension. This kind of looks like a Ram Rebel. Now I saw in the comments someone said the tires look too aggressive for stock tires, but they really don't. They <laughs> They look very, very normal for stock tires, what you'd get at the dealer if you bought one today. So we're going to take it to the torture test and see how this does. Yeah, the winter tires definitely do good. It's not too OP. The sounds are decent. The braking is good. The steering's responsive, but not too much, not too little. This is actually kind of what I was looking for in a Scout. Um, the model on it is really good. The lights are extremely realistic. Actually, you can see the tracks from where I was playing earlier. So we'll keep going. I'm going to pop it in a high here, though. We'll just cruise through this snow. Like a real ram would. And that was it. Didn't struggle at all. Get up to the pit, see how we do. So I, th I honestly think if I do have an issue here, it is going to be with the ground clearance more than anything. But we'll pop it in a low and see how we make out sure we're not digging ourselves. So far so good. And I spoke too soon. This might actually be as far as we can go. We're bottomed out. Yeah, I uh, don't think we're going to make it too far from there. So deep mud is not something this truck is capable of, it seems. We'll try the other side of the pit, just as one last kind of test. See how it does there. And we're making it. And that's kind of the thing about scouting around is that you know, if you get stuck, you try to winch yourself out and go a different way, ultimately. I can't see there being a whole lot outside of this mud pit that would be too tough for this. It does great in snow. Seems to do decent in... We almost made it to the end, it's this one tree branch. This winter cells just a tiny bit. And we made it out with a little winch. I'm gonna just go ahead and say it. And the interior's designed very nice. Um, I think this mod, we'll see, we'll see. I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna wait a minute.
And here we go. So I'm going to go ahead and give this mod a solid 7 out of 10. It couldn't make it through its torture test um, easily. We did have to winch a couple times ago on the kind of what I would consider the easier side. But the model on this is just, it's, I don't even know what to say about it. But it is perfect. It is extremely detailed, extremely realistic, and uh, it works the way, you know, this kind of truck should work. It's not OP. The only reason I'm not going to give it a 10 is the, for one, the tire upgrade options are very limited. There's only two tire options. And the other reason is it's generic, right? It's a generic 1500. They could have added the badging to make it a full-blown ram. I mean, it is a ram. It's got the headlights, it's got the grill, it's got the hood, it's got the tail lights. It just doesn't have Dodge or Chrysler branding. So, but I mean, the interior is awesome. Very detailed. Just everything about this mod was kind of, uh, I don't even know, just like, it's very extremely detailed. The other thing that I think could be good as a spin-off, like a 2500 edition, or 3500 edition, maybe a goose snack, or a fifth wheel hitch on the 2500 and 3500. Um, those are some ideas that I have. But this is a scout truck you could easily pack onto a trailer and take with you and know that once you kind of hit your limits with your work truck and you need to scout, you just unpack this and that's all you really got to do. And that's that's one of the things I like most about this mod, I would say. Um, but again, once you get down to the actual torture test and the pit it's just not as responsive as you would hope and it's not it's not fully capable now this pit is probably some of the worst mud you'll see in snow runner and um, for the longest period of time and also the deepest and so that plays a part in it but I think if you're gonna scout you should have something that's you know, very well capable of everything, and I feel bad giving it a 7 out of 10, because this mod does kind of, it's not OP, it just, it's very balanced, so, um, compared to some of the other mods, I would give this a 7 out of 10, just because, again, it did have its difficulty, but right there, we made it back through, um, if you just want to look at quality and realism, I'm going to go ahead and give this a solid solid 10 out of 10 no questions asked and even the lighting detail is just absolutely insane so thanks for tuning in guys you'll see this truck a little bit more and uh we're gonna be back with daily videos